podcast, so I don't know if you know, but recently, DayZ had a pretty decent size update on Xbox and PlayStation, and so I decided I would play it, maybe uh, try to see what the new stuff is, you know, with my luck, I probably wouldn't get out of spawn, but made it a little bit further than expected. Right now, it's literally pitch black, so you probably can't see anything. I'm gonna mess with the lighting as much as I can, the image quality will probably go down, but for the clips that I need you guys to see, I'll boost the uh, brightness, so if the quality's low, that's why. But uh, let me just play this first little clip for you. Oh my god. I'm peaceful. Dog, you punched me in the face, how are you gonna punch me in the face and then say I'm peaceful? Now obviously I boosted the brightness for you guys to see that from me playing, it was literally just a pitch black room and did not, I didn't see that person obviously, I just took damage out of nowhere. But just to uh, give you an idea, get the story going, you know, you know how these Daisy stories work. So, met this person and they were cool other than the time they tried to punch me. And so we decided to team up and we didn't go far before we met even more people that would join our team. I'm gonna go uh, check out that uh, that flare. If you hear a gunshot, it's me dying. Mike's set up right now. Oh, there's a dude. There's two dudes here. What's up, dudes? Hey. Oh, yeah. Hey. What's up? Are you family What's up? or? Yeah. I so since we all had relatively nothing, we decided we were gonna team up and head down the coast. And you know. I went on a lot of adventures with these random people. We did we did a lot of good things. I mean, we drank water and we filled our water bottles together. We fought some good old zombies together. Especially with that zombie part. I mean, I did most of the work because nobody else wanted to get hit. But that's not the point. We all friended each other on Xbox and got into a party together. We had powwows to decide which member of the group was going to get sacrificed to the zombie horde for the betterment of everybody else. Like, that one was a joke, but, you know, we still had powwows. It was, it was a community thing. But you know what? I've played a lot of DayZ. I've been betrayed a lot of times. So I couldn't help but thinking, you know, times like these when we're all standing in our circle deciding what we're going to do. I have four shells in my shotgun. Now, I'm not great at math, but by my calculation, there's just three of them and an extra one for myself. So it works out perfectly. But I restrained myself, and we, we headed to find more loot. And on our journey, we came across another person. And I don't know about you, but I was on a low population server. And this is the most people I have ever found on a low population server. I mean, I was just finding people left and right. It was freaking ridiculous. By the way, this is a stream. And that was some lag you just saw, but that was a sick-ass transition, so I'm keeping it in. But, uh, how you doing, dude? Uh, how you doing, dude? Enjoying this fucking awesome update. And this was another one of those times, so I was really counting the shells. I mean, you know, none of them have ammo in any of their guns. My aim isn't great, and by not great, I mean like stormtrooper level accuracy here. And, um, but you know, I have an extra shell. Can't kill myself anymore, but that's fine. I could totally take them, is what I'm thinking. This whole time, I'm like, I could totally take these guys. But then, then one, the new guy, he antagonizes me even more to absolutely dome him. Hold well, on, I'm gonna put on my new helmet. What the heck? I like my helmet. So right here is where I got real close. I'm just thinking, I could pop the three people that I've been traveling with, right? He would have no idea. He's completely blind under there. I could say, oh, someone else is shooting at us, right? He would have no idea that I killed them. And then I could just kill him and I could take all of the loot. But you know what? I, I refrained from doing so. To be honest, I kind of regret it because it just got even worse. And so we continue to go on looting, leaving the new guy we found. And for some reason, I don't know why, but they decide to keep giving me more and more ammo. It's like they wanted me to kill them. And I was so close to doing it. And honestly, I wish I had. I would have had loot. I could have I could have gone the other way. Could have could have still still been moving. But then uh then this happened. I might have seen somebody I'm cross moving. left in front of us. Oh my god. Find us. Find us. That was it. That's uh, that's how it ended. So more of the story is kill everyone early, take their loot early, and uh, every man for himself. See you on the next one.
Yay! My god, where'd it go? Oh, okay, it's right here. 